As part of our Jack's Best campaign presented by Visit Jacksonville, we have so many categories. In our last round of winners, we had a couple of categories. One was Best Sunset Views. The other was Dock and Dine. And one of those cases where one spot fits both categories. I'm at Palms Fish Camp off of Heckshire Drive. We're off of Clapboard Creek. I have the owners of Palms Fish Camp with me. Gentlemen, congratulations. Here is your plaque for the best place to dock and dine. And this is your plaque for best sunset views. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Interview over. Just kidding, just kidding. <laughs> This is amazing. How long have you guys been here on Clapboard Creek? Uh, we've been here since uh, we opened up July 1st of 2017. So we've been here two, just over two years. Two years, you guys have already been nominated for a couple of the best categories. Uh, how does that make you feel? It makes it feel wonderful. You know, you just said something. You said you've driven by a lot and never been in. That's what we hear all the time is when somebody finally comes in, they go, wow, this is a pretty good place. I mean, it's amazing. The views are just spectacular, and I've heard the food is amazing as well, but the opportunity to be able to come into a restaurant, not just drive up, but I'm out on the water. Hey, I want to pull up in my boat. Did you guys imagine that concept when you first launched this store? Absolutely. That was exactly why we decided to get into it. We both live in this neighborhood, and we saw this place and saw really an opportunity to not only have a great restaurant, but also serve the community and the neighborhood. It's been great. We put kids to work out here for their first jobs, you know, neighbors, and uh, we've been purchasing our fish from uh, local uh, commercial fishermen, just like the fish you see here today. I mean, we do it all fresh local. Now let's talk about this, because some people would be like, why do you have a fish right here? Fresh fish at that. But that is like one of the main principles that you guys offer. You try to offer the most fresh fish possible. You said that a man was out uh, at the shrimp boat earlier this morning picking out today's catch. That's correct. He, uh, Mark went this morning, picks up the shrimp right down the street on Hexer Drive and brings it right back up here to Hexer Drive. So we've got, what, uh, four miles of uh, travel that it takes to get to our restaurant for the shrimp. So pretty good deal for us. How does it make you feel to know that patron, patrons have been inside your restaurant and they were like, this is the place to be? Well, one of the things is, is our signature item is our Mayport shrimp. Mayport shrimp is a, is a big hit with the locals as well as people coming in. And, the, and if you've never had the Mayport shrimp versus shrimp other places, you definitely taste the difference of fresh seafood, but you also taste what a real shrimp is supposed to taste like. Oh, before we run, this right here is a Bloody Mary, I'm gonna say on steroids. What is this creation and who came up with it? Well, that's called the Big Mary. Actually, uh, Casey, uh, that, that works here, came up with it. She's our front end manager and what it consists of is a wonderful Bloody Mary. You can get without the crab and everything, but this is called the Big Mary and it has a fresh uh, blue crab from Jacksonville straight off the boat. Uh, Mayport shrimp straight off the boat, and uh, it's just garnished kind of uh, kind of interesting, and uh, we've, we've gotten some raves over it. I'd like to just point out one thing since it's right behind us. Not only are we a fish camp, but we also have a pizza oven for the kids that don't want to have, we serve pizza here and make our own pizza here homemade. Mic drop, people. Winners. All right, me and this big Mary, we're about to dance. <laughs> <laughs>